you know, it's as a shaper maybe when you're learning your craft and there's a mm -hmm. learning curve that mm -hmm. comes to shaping, mm -hmm. of course, like anything else. It doesn't stop. Really? No. Ongoing? It's ongoing. Every year, yeah. it's ongoing. Yeah. Well, I guess board design changes too. So well, it's, it's, I, I call it the spiral evolution, where one design at one year in space and time is here, and then throughout the, throughout the surfing time, uh, this design will pop up mm. five years later. It'll be this design, but it'll be, it's gone through all this evolution, but it comes back again at, up here. Yeah. And that, it never ends. It just keeps going and going and going. Are you using a machine now to cut? I do piece? both. Okay. I do, I, all my short boards are pretty much, I design on my, uh, my computer. Uh, some of the long boards I do by hand, some I do by computer. Um, just, and some, some of the oddball shapes, uh, it's faster, faster for me to hand shape it than to sit down and, and draw it. You know? Is it really? Oh yeah. Yeah, because I can just, my mind's like a computer. I, I just, you know, when I, if I can create things real easy, it's like peeling an orange or whatever, you know, I just, right. like, at there, I, I, I can either use a machine to create it or I can use my hands to create right. it. So I didn't give up my, my planning skills. Right. That's as good. far as so I can still, it's like an instrument, it's, you're still using it.